Hi, I'm Elle McCann from Curious Themes Web Development Studio in Nashville, Tennessee. And as you log into your Shopify backend of your store over the next few days, you may notice that it looks a little bit different. And that's because Shopify has rolled out a brand new backend design for all Shopify stores on their platform, as well as some of their apps. So what does this mean for you? And how is the new design actually going to improve your functionality and user experience while on Shopify? That's what I'm going to cover in this video today. So I hope you stay tuned for the rest of this video as we're going to dive right back into the back end of Shopify now. And I'm going to show you exactly what the new elements are. Okay, so here is the Shopify back end, which you're used to signing into. However, this is the new design. So as you can see, there's a lot more purple. Uh, it's very white and open. So there's new illustrations that you'll see here and throughout the site. Um, one of the biggest changes overall is just how the menu works on the left hand side here. So you can tell it's a lot brighter, um, but the items themselves are the same. So for example, let's click on products. So before, whenever you clicked on products, it would then take you to another second menu that would show up here, where now it shows it below here. So there's no second menu that you're having to go into that replaces the first one, which was what their previous design was. It just shows up underneath, and that's the same for online store as well. So this is very helpful because it helps you remember where you're at, um, and it's not all these different menus and dialog boxes that you're going through. So overall, with the new design, the functionality is the same. It's just stylized a little bit differently. Um, another great example of this is the settings, which I'll come down here at the bottom left-hand corner and click. So all of these options are the same as before. How you can edit your payment settings, a checkout, taxes, shipping. It's just instead of being that second menu again, it's all here in one location. So you can a lot more quickly click on what you need to get to. So overall, with the new design, Shopify's goal with this is to just be very consistent. So not only consistent with their own apps, like the mobile app um, and their point of sale app that they're releasing the new design for shortly, but also with third party apps. So the overall goal is to make everything consistent and match this branding. So they've released a platform that the app developers are now programming their apps on so and updating their previous apps so that everything is consistent and matches the new theme. This way, whether you're you know, going into an app to edit settings, you're on you know, the back end of Shopify, adding in new products, maybe you're on their mobile app, fulfilling an order or on their point of sale app, um, you know, using that in your store, all of that's gonna look consistent and feel the same instead of being disjointed and being different looks like how it was before. So that's a huge upgrade, but again, the functionality is very much the same there. The one big functionality change though is the search bar. So you can see it up here at the top, um, but whenever you click into it and type something, so let me just type in order. So you'll now see these suggestions pop up. So the quick action is to go ahead and create an order. So it's showing you here, these are the items that you can do related to orders in the Shopify backend admin. So you can create an order or fulfill an order. You can create a draft order, which you would then send to a client to pay. Um, you'll also see the resources area, which is their help center. So it'll show you exactly how to add in tracking to your order status page. So instead of having to go to their separate help.shopify.com to look up things that you're wanting to, um, that you have questions about, it's all right here that's showing up in Shopify. And the last thing is the apps. So with the term, the keyword order, we're pulling in the order printer app is a suggestion, which is a Shopify app that lets you customize your invoices and packing slips to match your branding. And also the house app, which is a sales channel app of Shopify that lets you connect your products with the house.com platform and lets you sell then on house. So these are things that before you would need to go to the app store or the sales channel area of your site 
to add these on, but instead of having to take you to another part of Shopify or another part of their online Shopify site, which is like the app store, the theme store, now you can pull all of that in straight from the search bar. So it's gonna just make it a lot more of a seamless experience. So I would love to hear what you think about everything. Um, so definitely reach out and let me know what you think or comment below this video and tell me what you like about the new Shopify, Shopify design. Maybe you don't like something. I would love to hear either way um, and enjoy.